Hey guys, it's me Jess. Welcome back to another video and today I'm vlogging and today's a very exciting vlog. I've just started getting contractions. I definitely think they're contractions. So this is the start of the birth vlog, so I hope you enjoy. If you do, thumbs it up and make sure to subscribe. And yeah, let's just get into it. So I woke up this morning, probably around seven o'clock. It late afternoon now and when i woke up i was getting like cramping kind of like period pain and it's still there and it's been coming off and on but it's been getting stronger and i thought oh it's probably you know braxton hicks or something but i think i'm in labor because i've been timing them um and they're only coming like every 20 minutes or something uh, but they're they feel like contractions so yeah, I thought I'd start Amy's birth vlog now while I'm not in too much pain so that we can film as much as possible. Um, but yeah, that's kind of what's happening. So I've been laying down in bed, but obviously during labour you're supposed to move. So that's what I'm going to do now. I'm going to put on my birthing ball, which is there. So yeah. So guys, this is my birth ball. I had a blue one with Amelia and I've got a yellow one this time, but I'm just bouncing on that just to see if it will help the pains and I think I'm gonna get Ryan in. Ryan! Ryan! Jess, 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 are you okay? Ryan, my contractions. Are they getting more closer together? Is my baby girl coming? Ryan, I don't know, but they're hurting a lot. I think maybe from the midwife. Sure, I'm on it. Dada, dada, what's going on, daddy? What's going on? Mummy's having pains. I think your sister might be here today. Yeah, I think. Yeah, she might be coming. Where's my phone? Oh, no. It's on the table, Daddy. Oh, yeah. There it is. Silly me. Hello? Hello, is that the hospital? Oh, hi. My wife's in labour. Um, I'll go in with her now. Jess, the lady on the phone's asking how often you're getting the contractions. <sighs> well, they were coming every 20 minutes. I was timing them, but they feel like they're coming more regularly than that now. Maybe like every 10 or something? Um, She says about every 10 minutes. Have you had any other symptoms? No, my water hasn't broke or anything. Oh. No, she hasn't had a water break or any bleeding, but she's in quite a lot of pain. Yeah, we want to have a home delivery. We've got a birthing pool. Okay, I'll set it up. Thank you very much. Will you be sending a midwife? Okay, thank you. Bye. Oh, oh, Ray, what did they say? <sighs> they said to keep doing your breathing and they said that they'll send a midwife as soon as one's available. Fingers crossed though. Amy will be here soon. Let me just go and get the... And I'm going to go and get the birthing pool ready. Oh, thanks, Ryan. You're welcome. Amelia? Amelia? Yeah? Daddy gonna go and set the water up for Mummy? Yeah. Your sister gonna come? Yeah. Okay, come on. I'm gonna go and do that. Oh, no, there's a baby on its way. Sorry about that, guys. Ryan's a little bit excited. But, yeah, my contractions are coming, so hopefully the midwife will be here soon, and one of us will update you when that happens. Ooh... Ooh. Hi guys, so it's me Ryan and this is Jess's birthing pool which we've got in the living room. I'm going to put a bit of warm water in it now to try and help her. She's just in so much pain, it's really hard to watch. Are you going to go and make mummy feel better? Yeah. Go and see her. Mummy, 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 what my Oh, hello precious. Mummy's okay, she's just in pain. Your little sister's coming. Yeah. Yeah, she is. Oh, Ooh. are you okay? I'll be okay. Mama. It's okay. Mwah. 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 Oh, you're so sweet. There we go guys, so I've just finished filling up the birthing pool. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I can't believe she's going to be here soon. 
the midwife is just on her way so i'll go and let her in but i'm so excited i'm gonna meet amy dada dada can i go swimming in here oh baby it's not for you it's for mummy it's not for us no we're not going to go swimming mummy's gonna go in there Oh. oh hello there i'm the community midwife i've been sent to come and assess someone for a home delivery oh yes that's my wife jess would you like to come in oh yes thank you hello there are you jess hogan oh, oh yes i am that's me hi i'm midwife barbie would it be okay if i do a few checks on you oh yes thank you oh it's all right baby i'm here would you like to come into the bedroom? Okay, thank you. It's just this way. It's okay, Rover. It's okay, boy. Don't worry. Don't panic. Daddy, Daddy, why is mommy gone? Don't worry, baby. Da Daddy's just, um, the ladies just took mommy in there to go and look at her. Amy's going to be here. Oh. Okay, so I've got your notes right here and it says that you're hoping to have a water delivery at home and you've got a birthing pool. Oh, yeah, I definitely want a home birth if I can, but I hope I can. But anyway, I've got a birth pool set up. My husband did it. The lady on the phone told us to. Yeah, that is brilliant. And have you had any problems during your pregnancy? Um, No, not really. Everything's been fine. Okay, well, I'm just going to give you a little examination. So first, I'll listen to a baby's heartbeat, and then I will need to check to see if you're dilated. So would you be able to change into something a bit more suitable for me to be able to do that? Yeah, sure. And how many minutes apart are your contractions? Uh, maybe like 15 or something. I don't know. It was 15 minutes earlier, but I feel like they're coming more frequently. Okay, well, I can check all that. Okay, so while you're between contractions, let's just have a little listen to baby. Oh, oh. There we go, that's okay. She does seem a little distressed, so I'll have to keep an eye on that. What do you mean distressed? I don't know, I just need to keep an eye on her heart rate. Oh, okay, I'll give you some gas and air to help with the pain. Yeah, I need some. Does that feel better? Yeah, thank you. Okay, that's great. So you keep taking in the gas and air, Jess, and I'm going to check how dilated you are. Okay, so let's just have a look. Um, Your water hasn't broke yet, has it? No, not yet. Okay, that's okay. You look about three centimetres. Oh, it's taking longer this time. Yeah, sometimes that happens. Yeah, you look definitely about three. So that's okay. We'll keep an eye on it. But we do need to keep an eye on baby because she's getting a little bit distressed. Is that bad? Well, it's not ideal, Mr. Hogan. It's okay, Jess. I'm right here. Ryan, what if we can't have a... I can't do it. I'm sure you will. I get, can she go in the water now? Yes, of course. You can definitely try the birthing pool. Is it all set up and ready to go? Yeah, I've done it. Oh, that's great. Yeah, definitely try that. Come on, Jess. Let's get you out, out into the living room. <sighs> oh, hi, guys. I don't know if you heard what the midwife said, but they. I need to go and get ready to go in my birth pool now. Even though I'm not dilated, she said it might help me with the contractions. I've been giving gas and air and it's helping a bit. So hopefully, fingers crossed, the birthing pool will work. This is labour. It's getting intense. Jess, how are you feeling? Oh, Ryan. Oh. All right, darling. It's okay. Mama. Mama. Hello. Oh. Ready, what's the matter with Mama? It's okay, baby. Mummy's just in labour, that's all. Papa. Yeah. It's all normal, Amelia. We just need to make sure we're keeping an eye on that baby's heartbeat. <sighs> it's okay, Jess. Keep breathing. <sighs> Ryan. <laughs> oh, is it normal for her to feel like this? 
she does seem to be in quite a lot of pain let's just check baby because baby was getting a bit distressed Jess I'm just going to look at you oh, Ryan. all right let's just have a look at you quickly okay that doesn't sound too good it seems like baby might be a little bit distressed what no no it's okay baby just try and stay calm Ryan I don't she was going to be okay It'll be fine, but it might mean we need to transfer to hospital. Because of the signs that baby's showing, I think it would be best for Jess and baby if we did transfer to hospital. All oh, right, Jess, what do you think? Oh, I really wanted to have a home labour, but if it's better for baby... Yes, and it might have to be a C-section. Really? Yes, because then we can get baby out so that she doesn't get more stressed. Oh, okay, Ryan... Stay with me. It's okay, darling. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> okay, guys, so we're going to end this vlog here, I think. Yeah? Yeah, we'll do another bit at the hospital. Okay, because I've got to get Jess ready and we're going to have Emma come round to look after Amelia for us. So, obviously, we're not going to really film much more now. And I'll try and film a bit more when Jess has her c-section because it's a big shot that she's got to have a c-section and we need to get a lot of things sorted so that'll be in another video hope you enjoyed say bye jess bye guys wish me luck okay